File 20067566. Date 10-01-1998. Case name, The Couple. Final conclusion, undetermined. Contents of folder, Kerman Grainy Diary Excerpts from 08 26 1998 to 10-12-1998. Without further ado, let's begin. Excerpt 1, 08 26 98. Well, since Gina got me this journal, I might as well use it. So, yeah. I, I just got married to the love of my life. Gina avails Gainey <laughs> about two weeks ago, and you know what? <laughs> I couldn't be happier. Now, we, we just have to find a house, which shouldn't be too hard. Excerpt 2, 08, 29, 1998. I think we found a house we want. It, it's, it's a lot more than what we need right now, but the price is amazing. Hell, we might as well be getting it for free. Excerpt 3, 090198. Well, we got it. <laughs> the, the retailer seemed very nervous when we inquired about the house. He, he rushed us through everything, wanting to get it done really fast. Kind of put me on nerve, but you know what? The house is so cheap, I, I, I can't even think about that right now. Excerpt 4, 90598. Everything seems to be well. It really didn't take much to move in, so we settled pretty quickly. The house feels a little odd, a little bit of water damage, uh, nothing that can't really be fixed. Um, we got it such at a low price, I think that fixing the roof should be no hassle whatsoever. Excerpt 5, 09, 14, 98. Gina's laughing at me because she says that I write in this thing entirely too much. <laughs> Clearly she hasn't really read what Little Axie did write in this. Yet, she talks on the phone for hours on end. Women. <laughs> you gotta love them. Anyways, we, we found out we have a little one on the way. A little me walking around this old house. I'm so damn excited. Can't wait. Till next time. Excerpt 6, 09-20-98. Now, this one was a little hard to read due to the fact that this page only had one entry on it. The page also seems to be, con well, covered with what seems to be dry tears. <laughs> Today is the worst day of my entire life. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Gina miscarried. Excerpt 7, 09-23-98. With everything that's been happening to me and Gina, we have been fighting. I love her more than anything. I, I would die without her. Otherwise, things have been good. I, I guess. Things has been something's been bugging me though. I've been I've been hearing Footsteps at random times at random intervals yesterday. I heard footsteps approach me from behind while I was typing a document for work Gina told me that she's been seeing things out of the corner of her eye and I researched her I, 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 I reassured her and To a certain extent I, I, myself This is an old house and so noises and lights and things that can play tricks on you can seem I guess normal at times. Excerpt 8, 09, 23, 98. Entry number 2. Oh, oh, okay. Something is definitely up. I, I got up to get a glass of water, and when I looked down the hallway, I swear I say I, I saw a figure with yellow eyes staring straight at me. I rubbed my eyes, and it was gone. Was that my imagination or what? This is crazy! Excerpt 9, 09, 26, 98. I, I went to the basement to restore power to the breakers after they were tripped. As I went down there, I, I was trying to open a box. I felt something watching me. I, I could have sworn I saw something move in the darkness right out of the corner of my eye. 
I got as quickly as I could. Gina had been stressing me out more and more as this house is haunted or something. <sighs> I'm starting to believe her. Excerpt 10, 09, 26, 98. I just had a horrible dream of me murdering Gina. And for God's sakes, enjoying it. Maybe I need help. Th this kind of dream is, is not healthy at all. Excerpt 11, 09, 29, 98. Entry number two. Me and Gina have been getting into fight about getting into fights about money. Well, it just happened before with something different. I wanted to hit her. I'm not even joking. I had to hold myself back from slapping her. What am I, a man from the 50s? God fucking damn it. I've never ever had these thoughts before. I went to a friend that was studying psychology and he says that I need to find a stress reliever. That I'm okay. No, I'm not. Whatever. I'm just fucking worried. Excerpt. 12, 10, 01, 98. I'm seeing faces in the mirror. Dead, disgusted faces. Once even appeared right before me. I can feel these things watching me as I write this. It's this weird mummy looking thing staring right at me. God, what the hell is happening? Excerpt 12 10 03 98. <sighs> Today's been horrible. I can't get any sleep because of this nightmare's face as. The nightmare's faces, and Gina has been getting more and more pissed off at small things as I do. She's getting highly annoying. God damn it. Excerpt 13 10 05 98. So. I got angry today. I slapped Gina. Bitch deserved it. Maybe she wouldn't be such a stubborn whore anymore. 10. 08 98 I keep seeing the yellow-eyed creature. It's become daily now. Yesterday I saw it appear in front of me. I can't even describe it. Th the bits that weren't covered by the um, bandages was bits of dead skin that was rotting off. Its teeth seemed razor sharp. There was a scary thing though. It made me want to kill myself. I had a knife in my hand and I, I stabbed it. But as soon as I did, its weird body just kind of disappeared. Strange. I should definitely look into this. I'm gonna go see my psychologist friend soon. This is just... unreal. Warning. The entries get a little bit more violent at this point, and we simply stop numbering them. So, let's begin. 10, 11, 98. I'm so sick. It hurts writing. My hands, they burn. I, I, what the fuck? 10, 11, 98. I'm gonna kill that bitch. I'm gonna fucking kill her. I'm gonna stab her. <laughs> I'm gonna stab her when she falls asleep. 10, 11, 98. <laughs> stab, stab, stab! Everyone join in. Oh, oh, God, yes. <laughs> the feeling of the knife going across the horse's throat. That was intoxicating. It's like sex! Ripping those slut's eyes out were the funniest things. <laughs> She'll save on glasses. <laughs> Dead bitch learned a lesson. Excerpt 10, 12, 98. Oh my god. What have I done? Oh god. 
<laughs> what have I done? My beautiful wife. <laughs> She's dead. I was holding a knife. It was just like the dream. It's this house. This bastard house. That's why it's so cheap. How many others have died? Wait, what's that? Ah! Coroner's report slash autopsy. Coroner name, Jonathan Bo Brown. Victim one, Gina Graney. Death resulting from laceration wounds to the neck and resulting in blood loss. There's several stabs to her upper and lower body post-mortem. Her eyes also have been gouged out of the sockets while appears while she was alive due to the evidence of struggle. She must have been alive for a good 20 minutes of stabbing. I haven't seen anything like this in 20 years. Victim 2. Cameron Graney. Cause of death came from wounds from the neck. What caused them? I have absolutely no idea. It seems like the throat was ripped out from what I assume is an animal, but yet... It could have been, It almost looks like it was done from uh, digited fingers or something like that. The strength was only something that an animal could do. What really got me was some of his organs were missing, mainly the heart, stomach, as well as kidney. I I'm at a loss from here. I, I hope they didn't suffer too much. However, the organs um, appear to be um, before the actual death took place, at least the end of the heart stopping, uh, with the heart removal being the thing that actually killed him. Whatever killed him, wanted him to suffer, which is horrifying. 